have read through the 45 pages of this indictment. And quite frankly, it reads like an MSNBC Rachel Maddow monologue. Uh, they talk about President Trump, quote, determined to stay in power, quote, determined to spread lies. Truth is, you can't charge someone on spreading lies. There's free speech in America. The only problem is President Trump didn't lie about anything. And when you read through this indictment, it spells out every election integrity irregularity, every problem that I called out since 2020. It basically makes the case for President Trump that the election was stolen, and this is how dumb they are. I'm actually celebrating this indictment today. This indictment is the greatest indictment to ever happen to President Trump, because do you know what it means? It means discovery, baby, discovery. When you have a court case like this, President Trump can now open up the books of every state that he called into question. Why? Because Jack Smith is such a dope that he laid out every single claim of President Trump of election fraud in Michigan, dead voters in Arizona, people in Pennsylvania acting wrong, concocting votes in the mail-in ballot scheme in Georgia, all of it brought up by Jack Smith, which now means President Trump and his team can subpoena every single person surrounding the election in these states. And just think, if you can raise reasonable doubt in just one state because of this indictment of President Trump, the entire House of Cards falls down. The entire election now gets called into question, which is actually what I said. We know that there was election fraud. We know that the election was stolen from President Trump. And now, President Trump gets a chance to prove it. And even more than that, he gets to haul in every one of these devious Democrats who concocted the mail-in ballot scheme and every other scheme laid out on this program and others. Folks, this is great news for President Trump, even though it's a witch hunt, even though it's bogus, even though he has the right to free speech. When you talk about discovery, boy, you talk about opening up a can of worms, it'll end up being a can of whoop-ass on Jack Smith and the Democrats. This is Jack Smith, cut 16.